Hey guys, welcome to another video. Here I'll show you how to kill all mobs plus boss in both Cathedral and Armory in a single pull. For these pulls, you will need a decent amount of gear and experience, a specific talent tree, and two limited invulnerability potions. Double frost resist rings are also highly recommended. This method gives the best XP per hour possible compared to any other SM circuit out there because you're literally killing every single mob in both instances and top of that you're doing the boss. I can easily fill up my group even when I charge 10 gold per person which results in a 40 gold circuit and amounts to earning 200 gold per hour. The demand for this pull in my server is extremely high. The demand and prices for other servers may vary so it all comes down to your strategy. To start off this pull you want to wait for this mob to pass by, walk through this spot and blink in front of the boss. Make sure to have your shields up at all time including frost ward and pull the boss. When you pull the boss, you're going to automatically aggro every single mob in the cathedral. Blink here and then frost nova here. Make sure you're using rank 1 spells every time you pull a mob and make sure you have your PvP trinket equipped because if you get slowed in the middle of this pull you're highly likely to die. Make sure you refresh your frost wards as it has a 20% chance to reflect any incoming frost bolts. Over here let the mobs come close to you and then jump off. Here some of the mobs got really close to me but that's okay because I blink on this spot anyway. From this point on, I don't use my ice barrier to show that mana shield is more than sufficient to mitigate any incoming damage. And every time I resist a frost bolt, I get some mana back. Blink here. And don't worry about pulling any mobs, as the mobs those are chasing you are going to pull them anyway. And if you see some mobs are getting close to you, you can use a frost nova at this point. I have this neat weak aura that shows how much damage I can absorb before my shield disappears. I blast this mob and use a rank 1 arcane explosion here. Now this is the point where all those frost resist comes in handy because you'll get hit by a ton of frost bolts and most likely get slowed. If you do just use a trinket. When you're here use all your shields and frost wards and ice block. Make sure you're spamming your limited invulnerability potion when you're about to come out of your ice block. Use Arcane Explosion 3 times and then Frost Nova. Notice that you cannot freeze the boss, but luckily he has a very low IQ and we can use that to our advantage. Rank 1 Blizzard on top of the ledge and then jump down with the max rank Blizzard. Whenever the boss comes close to you, jump up and down the ledge and keep using your Blizzard. All the mobs will eventually die and the boss will be really low HP. Now once you kill the boss, he won't drop any loot. You have to kill him again to get the loot. Once you kill white main, the boss is going to get resurrected and going to come towards the main boss room. Once you kill him there, you can loot him. Once you properly execute this pull, you will have cleared the entire instance down to the last mob in just one pull. Now let's use the same idea and apply it in armory. Shields up and pull the boss using a max rank frost bolt. Now we run back and pull the first pack with arcane explosion. Blink through this huge pack of mobs over here and arcane explosion again. Right over here you want to use a frost nova. Pull that pack with a cone of cold. Run away, little girl. An arcane explosion here again. Refresh your shields and blink. Arcane explosion here as you go down the hall. Here again. 
and here. And at this point, you want to Frost Nova again. Counterspell this pack over here. Another Arcane Explosion here, and Blink. Fire Blast this pack. And keep pulling along the way with whatever spells you have. And make sure you can refresh your Frost Barrier at this point of the pull. You want to Arcane Explosion the last pack, jump here and Ice Block. That way, all the mobs will stack nicely underneath you. Make sure you're spamming your lip as you're coming out of the Ice Block. Arcane Explosion three times, and Frost Nova. Use your Mana Shield and do a Flame Strike Shatter combo. Once you hit them, kite them with your Arcane Explosion and try not to get stuck by the dummy here. Cold snap and freeze them again. Shield up and do another shatter combo. And they should all be dead. Once all the mobs are dead, evocate and bandage up whenever the boss is spinning and then you can kill him pretty easily. Now, I have to say it right here. These pulls are not easy. It took me quite a few attempts till I could consistently do it without dying. A lot of things can go wrong depending on the RNG, but with enough practice you will learn to handle those problems. Practice makes perfect. Thank you for watching and make sure to hit that subscribe button. Until next time.